Hey, welcome back to No One Survived. In this season, we play with hardcore difficulty settings as shown here, including permadeath, which means I lose all skills and any tech I learned since my last death. Three times the amount of zombies spawn and zombie strength is set to max. Virus death rate set higher than hardcore, so I can die easier from viral infection when my antibody stat reaches zero. Loot distribution is set to rare, so very few containers have loot in them. Not only that, but the amount of loot in the containers is minimal. The loot respawn interval is set to zero, so absolutely no respawn. What I find is what I get. See how that iron's doing? Uh, looking pretty good. I think the first building I'm going to work on is probably the housing. And in order to get that done, I'm going to need... Uh, actually, I'm going to need to fill this up first, so I think it's time to go and get a bunch of rock, which really sucks. Probably use some sleep and food, too. Not sure what I got for food here. Probably get these built, too. Maybe I'll uh, grab a couple hours here of sleep and uh, look at getting a couple of the cultivation boxes built in there just to test them out. At some point I'm going to have to go out for some rock. really like to complete this because, you know, having to cook water all the time, I don't like that. It really sucks. This would make things a lot easier. I'm just going to do it. So I got four steel bars in there. I'll put a couple. Well, that should give me enough steel now, I think. And uh, I'll need nine advanced parts. I'm going to run out to probably this point of interest right here that I created. There should be some mushrooms there and I can get some rock on the way. Yeah, my stamina is pretty low. Yeah, we'll grab some of that meat here and uh, I need protein too so I may as well cook that up
Such a nice convenience to be able to clean up here now. There we go, looking a lot better. Let's see how that steel is doing. I'd like to get a couple more. There we go. Should have enough for the faucet. I don't know where I put my car. Ah, there it is. I don't think I'm gonna burn up any fuel for the rocks and just gonna run out and grab it. It's gonna take quite a bit longer, but they can't afford the fuel right now. Not till I get the blueprints to make fuel. There's no real point in uh, wasting it. Be nice if they introduce like a rock quarry into the game where you can just run and, and fill your car up with stone rocks everywhere like a basically a mine for stone that'd be kind of cool I should have some iron in those two red furnaces that I have built by the ore field. I should probably pick those up on the way home. And I'll need some clay for brick for the buildings. The one building I think is like 30 bricks, so uh, it's going to be quite a bit of clay and stone actually. Not sure if I've got the weight room for that. Uh... Oh, I got some mushrooms over here too. Um, for that iron, gotta figure out where where it is. It's hard to see. I don't remember how many were here. I thought it was four. I could be wrong. But well, that should keep me fed. 
for a little bit anyway. I'm going to take this down so I can fill in the blocks underneath it. I know some of you said that I don't need to fill in the blocks underneath, but um, I'd just rather do it. Okay, yeah, I can start filling this up. Uh, I need quite a bit. Like, a lot of stuff. That wire is going to be tough to get. All right. I'll hang on to some of this rock because I'm pretty low here, I think. Oh, I made three too many. That's okay. Oh, yeah, I did do an extra one because I know I'm going to end up using it. There we go. Fresh water. should have a filter here somewhere there it is i wish you can store filters in here like backup filters yay oh that bottle's just about done this one's still good Now it makes way more sense to use a canteen to drink out of. Yeah, that works out really good. Lots of stuff goes in here. 20 brick toolboxes. That electrical wire. Um, I might have enough for this. Yeah, barely. I think it was iron that I needed. Wasn't really paying attention. Yeah, 10 iron. 10 advanced parts. Wow. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to have enough iron. I'm going to have to wait, I think. Fifteen fur, lots of fabric, fine fabric. Oh, I don't know if I have that. I might have to break some clothing down. Two there. Need fifty of those. Oh yeah, I got enough. Glad I kept that skin. Fifteen fur. I thought it was five. Oh boy, I, I may not have enough. Might have some in my car too. I do have enough. Look at that. 25 cement and 10 advanced parts. I don't have the cement. I'll have to make some. Oh, I need iron ore for that. Uh, I'm going to have to leave, I think, because I don't have any iron ore left around here.
get a couple of these built just to get an idea. So we need two iron ingots per. Uh, the plastic should be okay. The planks, no problem. Simple parts should be okay, I think. I might only be able to get the five in here. I'll have to make more parts, I think. Oh, okay, so this is how I connect. Perfect. So we have a water source. And I'm going to go ahead and plant some seeds now. And it's it's going to be a food type. So I can eat, basically, and uh, get some rotten food, too. Start with some tomatoes. Is there a reason why moisture is still at zero, even though I have uh, have a water source? That's weird. Zero percent sunshine, so I can't grow in the winter. Um, little confused about this. Just make sure we got some water in here. We should. It should be fairly full. Also, never did really. Um, check for sure to make sure that I can hook the water up to here. Pretty sure I can. Yeah. So that won't be a problem. Same with the power. Power should be no problem at all. Yeah, I don't I don't know why there's uh no moisture here. I'll go ahead and add some but 0% sunshine, is that because it's it's winter? That's not good. I should try another box. Maybe on the other end here and see if I get any sun from it. Just wait for one more bar of iron. I'm going to try something different though. I'm going to hook the water up after I get the seed planted. Good thing I uh, made a lot of seeds or saved a lot of seeds. Well, it shouldn't really matter, right? That no sunshine's really got me worried, though. I, d I don't know what's wrong here. Uh, let's try this one. Same thing, no sunshine. So weird. I'm just going to leave this one for a little bit and see if that moisture comes up. Or if that one goes down. Actually, I'll put one water into it. Got me a little paranoid. There we go. We'll see if that goes down. Maybe it, maybe it won't go down. I don't like that no sunshine thing, though. I don't really mind getting rid of the greenhouse if, uh, like, I put a lot of work into it, but I don't mind getting rid of it if, if I can't get it to work properly. I can just get my NPCs to, uh, oh, and that's just a regular large stew. I expected a rich one because my cooking skill is at five. That's too bad. Yeah, I don't know what happened there. That's weird. If I get a little sun with that one. Yeah, zero sunshine. I'm not sure why. Like, there should be at least a percentage there, like one or two percent. You know, I can't imagine zero unless it's. Well, it is nighttime, sort of. And that moisture isn't going down. 
Neither is that one. I will see what happens. Plank and clay. So I can take those down for plank and clay, but I don't really need it. Looks like I'm going to have to go to another ore field also because I'm going to need um, iron ore to make the, uh, the cement. And I think the best one to go to is the one by the electrical trainer here. And I can see what books he has on him. And that way I can uh, get rid of some of my tradables here. As well get that stock on the uh, SMG. Oh no! Damn it! I did it again. I I hit maintenance instead of mods. <laughs> I wasted my only oil that I had. So that should give me quite a bit to trade. Um. Probably bring a little bit of ammo with me. Uh, it's probably all in the car already. So that'll give me six more, and I don't remember what I needed over here. Maybe six? Uh, no, I need seven more. Oh, well, now we got 100% sunshine and 100% moisture. So I guess it just takes a little bit to kick in. Yeah, now it's working. That's good. Good to see. I may as well make some fertilizer. And while that's cooking, I am going to go to an ore field, but while that's working, I'm going to grab a few more rocks here that are close by. Or relatively close. Okay, I guess we're going to go. I can't believe how quick my energy is draining and my food too. Let's 
So yeah, we'll hit this trader. There's a small ore field right here. I don't know how much iron is there, but there should be enough to make the cement and uh, give me a respawn on my iron ore here. May as well grab these rocks because they'll respawn um, or they should respawn when I get back. Not sure if I had another special forces gun, and I do. Should be good to go. Yeah, the location's really good to, like, uh, get to a lot of places without wasting too much fuel. If I had built where I normally build, like in last season, uh, I would really have a hard time um, managing my fuel because I'd have to go so far to get anything. So central is key, I think. You just got to take the good with the bad. Getting pretty close to spring here too, which means man at camp time. Uh, I'm, I don't think I'm prepared at all. I need some iron for the traps that I want to set up. Oh yeah, the, there's a farm down here and uh, there should be some boar or wolves actually in that direction. Gonna make sure I avoid those. Yeah, I'm too far south. Oh, and there's a trader there. Hopefully he's got some food as a gift. Nothing. He 
see what he's got for sale. Uh, wind turbine, which I already have. I think I've got egg one and three. That's not a hard skill to bring up. Tailoring volume two. I think I have one and two. I was hoping for a tailoring book, actually. I do got to get rid of some weapons here. I just don't remember what medicine book I had. I did make some notes on what I needed, so I'll have a look at those and uh, try this again. Let's just grab some weapons. So I do need mechanics too. It's not that important because it's it's one of the easiest skills to bring up. All you got to do is make arrows, and uh, it goes up pretty quick. So, but I do need two uh, medical. I need two, three, four, five. I have volume one. This is going to be expensive, I think. Oh yeah, we're already at one twenty-five. And uh, engineering. I don't even have an engineering book. I think I traded them all off. Cooking. I don't believe I had in my crate. I don't have any notes on it, so we'll take it. Three and five. Uh, egg, I need two and three. So there's volume two. No, sorry, I need one, four, and five. I need volume two. I've already got that. Tailoring, I need three, four, and five. So I don't need these. I'm going to move them. I don't think it'll reset. So I'll I'll go with that. That'll be fine. Uh, let's take whatever he's got left here. 58. This will give me about 40. 45. 61. That looks good there. All right. So we got some more books. Definitely use the medical books. Um, I might even be able to use it right now. Medicine is that, yeah, I can use that level five book to bring my medicine up to level five. That's good. That works. Awesome. I got a lot more room. I could use something to eat. I think I still have my camp over at the uh at the ore field there, so maybe I'll I'll eat when I get there. I can't remember. I did tear some of it down. I don't remember if I took the fire or the camp away. Just set my respawn while I'm here because there are wolves, and they're pretty close. This is a very small ore field. Hopefully, I can find what I need here. Just empty out my pack. Oh, I don't have a pot. That's fine. I do have some canned food with me. Maybe I'll eat that. Somewhere. There we go. That's a really good meal right there. That brought me up quite a bit. I'll save the rest. We'll get rid of the stuff. And this shouldn't rot before I get out of here. I should be okay. Oh, it got dark. Oh man, I hope there's some iron here. Look at that, there's a wolf right there. I don't need a lot of iron, just enough to make what, like 10 bags or so of uh, concrete. I don't think I have any arrows on me either. And that should be enough to make the concrete. I think it was one ore per. But I'll grab whatever's here. Holy cow, it looks like there's more iron here than there is at my ore field. And mine's bigger. That isn't the distance there, that big, uh, oh, it's a street sign, I see. Uh, 
Uh, that's a rock. It's about the same amount of ore at my as as uh, around my house. That's it. I think that's all the iron we're going to get. We got more than enough to finish the project. Or we should, anyway. Like I said, I think I only need, like, I don't know, half a dozen, maybe ten bags of concrete. I don't see any more iron here. Just got to be careful because, oh yeah, there's a wolf there. Yeah, I think we're out of here. I'll just grab a bunch of rock on my way home because I'm going to need it. And if I drive by it, I'll regret it. Once a rock is down, I don't have to worry about it again. So it's a, it's a one-time thing. It's a process. And we're day 39 at 2 a.m. So spring is real quick. It'll be tomorrow. So we'll probably head the same way home and grab as much stone as I can on the way home. Hopefully I don't damage my car too much. Pretty much guaranteed to damage it a little bit though. I tell you, I sure do miss that steel pickaxe. Usually it's way more spread out for me, but this is a really good find here. And it looks like my stats are getting low. I still have some canned food on me. I can eat that if I need to. Oh, and look at that, a mushroom. Two mushrooms and another one, a third one. nice to see all that foundation filled up. I don't even know what direction I'm heading in. 
Uh, wow, there's two big mushroom spawns here. We are going the wrong way. I want to be, I think, going in that direction there. I'm actually going home, so I want to be going south, but there are some mushrooms up there, but I did grab them. I don't know if, uh, I don't know if they respawned or not, though. I don't want to use that canned food, actually, because I'm pretty close to home, and I'd like to, uh, like, I can get something to eat there. I want to cook up these mushrooms. If I use that canned food now, then the mushrooms are kind of a waste. They'll end up going bad. Just got to get out of here. I'm going to lose half my stamina bar pretty quick here, too. I don't think I have a pot with me. If I do, maybe I'll have a look, but I don't think I brought one with me. If I did, then I can just cook it right here. I'll have a look when I need it, though. And there goes my stamina. should be pretty much a straight shot home. I think that'll be it for the rocks. Unless I see like two or three together. And oh yeah, that's the ore field down there. Maybe I'll grab that iron. If it respawned. Hopefully I got far enough away. And I'm not seeing any yet. Uh, I think I see one here. Yeah, it looks like it respawned. That's good. That's uh, limestone. I think that should do it for the iron. Home sweet home. Should probably get that concrete started right away. Let's go see what I need for this building here to finish it off. And one advanced part and uh, eight bags of concrete. Oh, I need limestone too. There we go, that's going to take a little while to make, I think, and uh, put the rest of this iron into this guy here to process it. Actually, I'll hold off. I'll hold off for now. I want to make sure that I have more than enough. Uh, I'll use it as I need it. So if I need nuggets, I'll, I'll process it. If I need concrete, I'll process it. It'll just take longer, that's all. Probably get something to eat. I, I know I have some older mushrooms in one of the bags. Oh yeah, look at all that iron. 
There we go. We'll go ahead and queue up a whole row of nuggets here. All right, let's look at some food and sleep. I'll get the sleep first. Let's see if that meat's rotted. If it hasn't, then I'll use some to cook with. Yeah, that one's gone. Uh, is that all I had? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, so it's gone. I'll have to use the jerky. Or I can just cook the mushrooms too. So we want a protein-rich and a carb-rich meal here. There's a protein, and this one will be carbs. Get cleaned up. Um, ah, I don't want to burn the food. There we go. We're looking pretty good. I'll just get cleaned up real quick. All right, let's get rid of some of this rock. Probably do these uh, bits of foundation here. I don't like the blue. I don't like running up and down. I'll just try to get this filled in here. Really glad I stopped for all that rock. Oh, it's nice to see another full pack, or almost full pack. I thought I was pretty much out of the stone. So I might actually be able to take down some of the blue buildings here and, and get the uh, foundation underneath. Might have enough for that. Just look at um, what I've got here. Uh, this is the uh, Leisure Club. And what does it require? Nothing, nothing major. 20 wire. Okay, that's pretty bad what is this one here this is the other house how many houses did I put out here there's one here yeah I got three houses out I didn't realize I really only needed two one for sure but and then this is the third so we have medical leisure oh I'm missing the uh, the canteen right yeah, I think I got the wrong buildings out. All right. So in that case, we'll keep probably keep these two houses there. Well, I got to look at the building here and see what it looks like. Yeah, that's the one I wanted. I must have picked the house accidentally. I'll probably put the canteen right there. Or I could put it here. Keep the housing together. Actually, the canteen would have been good right there, and then the houses beside each other right here. I think I'm going to do that. How much room do I have? I might have enough room for everything in here. Like, to take it apart and then uh, pick everything up. Why don't we get the last advanced part in there, and then all the stuff should go into my inventory. If I... Break it down while it's blue, it'll just fall on the ground. I don't want to look for it or accidentally lose anything. See how that concrete's doing? Uh, they're not running anymore, so they should be ready. Oh no, I screwed that up. Well, I got four bags here, I just gotta wait for these four. They're only 30 seconds a piece, it shouldn't take too long. Yeah, I'll put the housing broadside over here and the canteen over here beside the uh, leisure club 
I think that's it for stone. Oh, I do have a lot more. I'll just hang on to it until I'm done moving my buildings around. That way I know I've, uh, I've got exactly, uh, enough space for what I want to do here. Oh, I should have enough space. It shouldn't be a problem. I'm going to dump it in here for now, though. Oh, they're a minute apiece. Okay. Ah, screw it. We'll just take it off. Take it apart now. Uh, it's all going to fall on the ground, though. That sucks. See that? It's, like, didn't go into my inventory. I'm going to have to find everything. Well, uh, it looks like I got it all. Oh, there's some wire there. I don't want to lose that. Oh. Yeah, that works for me. They're mostly in line, so that should be okay. We'll fill this one first so I don't have to look at that blue one all the time. And yeah, we it looks like we picked everything up. We're just waiting for that concrete. I could just about get a third house here if I move all that stuff. But I think this is going to work for now. And we'll fill that up so I can uh, put the canteen down. Or try to get as much filled as I can. There we go. We now have housing. Still my favorite building, like, for being decorated. Absolutely favorite. I think it looks pretty cool. It's pretty nice. A lot nicer than uh, my accommodations. That's for sure. <laughs> Just about. We need another, what, 37? Not sure if I have that. Oh yeah, I got it. I just heard a bird, so that means it is now technically spring. Yeah, 1 a.m. day 40 spring. What's the temperature? Like zero degrees. I can actually get my armor put back on. I shouldn't have to worry about freezing anymore. I'm not sure if I want to offset it off to the back here a little bit. Or put it in line with the... Uh, with the medical building. I'm just going to see what this looks like. Yeah, I like that. That's fine. And we can start working on this building. Let's see how my plants are doing. They should be okay. Yeah, they're great. I don't know what that nutrient solution adds compared to the regular fertilizer. Other than it not expiring, I guess. I sure wish it would speed up the growth or the harvest, like maybe cut it in, you know, down by a third or so. Oh, I had stuff in here. Right, medicinal herb. I don't like that anyway. Makes my stuff disappear. So a lot more cement, 25 bags of cement and uh, electrical wire I'm going to have to make. I won't be able to find that. A lot of bricks. I need a ton more stone. But we'll get the concrete started. Just got to find some clay. Hmm. I don't think I have any clay left. Might have some in my bag here. And I'm going to need to make quite a few bricks too, so I may as well go out and get some clay here. Yeah, I got five clay there, but that's for uh, an egg bench if I need it. My pick is just about done too. I'll need to uh, make sure that I have what I need to make another one.
Okay, I'll run and grab some clay, maybe some more rocks. Thing is, I'm completely out. That'll be it for this video, and you know what to do to show your support. Appreciate all the comments. Thanks for watching.